My name is Jeanette Opiog, and I am a co-chair on the Branding and Marketing Committee for Place Matters Baptist. Hi, everybody. My name is Gio Lopez, and I'm also a co-chair. Uh, thank you for joining us today. And just a few updates on our committee is currently we are trying to name a brand. Um, current, like at this point, we have decided our brand name is going to be based on like the identity of Memphis. So like when someone reads name or see the logo or something like that, they automatically know this is this is something that represents Memphis. We have very rich conversations about what Memphis is for every single one of us. Obviously, as individuals, we have different perspectives, different experiences. Me as an example, as an immigrant in Memphis, and it was very interesting to listen to each other and also to know that there are so many parts of Memphis that many other people who live in Memphis consider, consider themselves as Memphians, Memphians doesn't know among the, about Memphis. So I think um, from this experience, I can say that Memphis is very colorful and I'm excited about what uh, is gonna come out from all this uh, research that Champions Design is doing. We are working with Champions as Gio has said, and I am excited to keep working with them. I also would like to see maybe in the future to have also the perspectives of other people from different neighborhoods. We talk about how important neighborhoods are for our community. Um, you know, the school that you went, the church that you go, and how that shapes a little bit your perspective and your experience about Memphis and how important that has to be at, at that time of um, find a name. We also talk about how we don't want to get a game in the same names that have been um, very common in projects or programs and how we need to find something that really talks about that grassroots organizing effort that Memphis does, the civil rights efforts and the people from that community who does a lot of work and usually are not in the media. Champions Design present some case studies to us about um, some, uh, in, you know, national uh, case studies that was very interesting um, to learn about it and to know. And uh, personally, for me, that was a really uh, good way to guide this uh, strategy for the branding. And um, I think uh, for me, as part of the committee, it was very helpful. I would have to agree with you on this. Um, it is very refreshing to understand what you're working with um, instead of like, you know, making like one-sided decisions. Um, I feel like it puts a sense of organization into it. Like we will be working on multiple projects and the fact that they are all going to be work following, like follow, follow, falls under like a single brand or single name puts much more like professionalism and organization into this of what we're working. So it seems like when, and I hope that when people say, see this brand or see this name somewhere, I'm like, yes, this is something I can trust and I'm happy to work with them. Yes, and something that uh, many people from our communities can relate to. Um, as I mentioned before, uh, Memphis is a very colorful, colorful city and we want to go a little far away from the mainstream of what Memphis is known as and actually get into the, the deep of the heart of Memphis. Um, I guess it's like multiple factors for me. Like I have, I start, I have started like my own advocacy groups at school. And because of that, like, I never realized how important it is, it is to have like a logo or a name or something like that attached to what you're working with. And um, I'm just excited to continue working on that aspect within this like group. Well, for me, language is a very important part of a program, a project, or a product, a service. It's very important how you communicate the goals, the vision of this uh, project. Um, because it needs to be related to different parts of the community. And um, it also needs to be in different languages. Uh, so different parts of that community also get involved and uh, feel that they are part of that.